488, take one A marker. Background action. Hey, 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 yeah. Now, careful now, buddy boy. All right. You're all right, Yank, huh? It's essentially the story of Rose Coyne, who is, uh, you know, an English woman living and working in rural Northern Ireland during the war. She's an outsider. She's surrounded by people for whom the war hasn't really affected their way of life. I play Michael Coyne. He works in the pub every day. He runs the farm. She's a school teacher and runs the grocery shop. Uh, the kids help out when they can. And because of this constant work that they do, there can be a vacuum sometimes. I play Rose Coyne. I suppose the story centers on Rose and Michael Coyne's family. I should imagine yeah. there are times when they could look at their marriage and go, where's the romance gone? All we're doing all the time is working and bringing up kids. Um, but there's a spark there and she she adores him, but there are times when she f she's feeling a little bit restless. Her soul gets a little bit starved, I think, in the marriage. Of course, it's the eternal love triangle. Uh, uh, a woman in a, in a marriage that has gone a bit uh, stale through custom and whatnot, and the, the environment she finds herself in. She's a, a woman who's alive to poetry and to uh, a, a, the imaginative life, and she's working in a shop and in a pub, and, and she meets a rather glamorous American airman. Mrs. Coyne! Captain Dreyfus! I have something for you. You may already have this. It's about the lake. They have a connection, and in, in, in some ways it's literary, in some ways it's um, a sense of humor, and in some ways it's just sort of maybe a place in life where they both feel that they're somewhere they don't belong, and at the same time they're at the perfect place. I was aware that there had been GIs in Northern Ireland during the war, but I, I never really thought about the impact that would have on our local population. You know, it, the, the kind of exoticism of Americans coming out, it's like they're from a different planet, really. When you put an American aerodrome in Moy Bay, or, you know, rural county Tyrone with some American soldiers, it's just magic. It's emotionally heartbreaking. It's funny. It's real life. 